What's up y'all? Welcome back to my channel on behalf of Britt. If you're new here, welcome. I'm Brittany and today's video is a week in the life vlog. I know recently I did like a holiday hair vlog showing y'all me braiding and getting some of my clients together for the holidays. But outside of work, I wanted to show y'all what life is like on the back end socially. So that's what this vlog will be. I have a graduation to attend this week. One of these days, I promise you I'm gonna do a quick weave, do something, pull myself together. Right now I got like a partial sew in. I'm gonna snatch this out, do something to my hair. I just wanted to pop in and say hello. We're gonna kick off this vlog with my friend's graduation. Today is Tuesday. My friend Justice graduates tomorrow with her masters. I'll be attending her graduation. Her cousin got shirts made. We have these cute little shirts. I have to insert a picture of it, hopefully sometime tomorrow. Um, before I walk into the ceremony, I have time to show y'all how it looks on me, but I'll insert a picture of how the t-shirt looks. So excited about that. So proud of you, Justice. And so right now I'm just trying to get her bouquet together because I know everybody's doing flowers. Probably I know at my graduation, I was bombarded with flowers, but I want to add a little razzle dazzle. So I got this little pick. Justice's favorite color is blue. And in addition to that, the school she's graduating from, Georgia State University, that's their school colors, royal blue and white. And so I got her this little cake topper. It's honestly meant to put on top of a graduation cake. It says she believes she could, so she did with the exact uh, color of her school. But I'm going to stick it into a bouquet. Lately, I don't know why it's been popping up on my Explore page, but I've been seeing a bunch of different crazy floor arrangements. Okay, so I wanted to do like a graduation theme. So I'm gonna put this uh, cake topper in it. Hopefully it looks cute. And then Amazon better count their days if this don't look right. <laughs> but I also ordered these little rhinestone picks that I'm gonna stick in each row. Be adding a little razzle dazzle to it. I'll show y'all how the bouquet turns out. But yeah, I just opened a quick little package and I said, let me go ahead and get the vlog going. I also brought myself a stress journal. I've mentioned this to y'all in vlogs before. Well, I love to write. Writing is very therapeutic to me. I keep a journal for everything. Even when it comes to my hair business, I have apps, I have calendars, I have dry erase boards, all kind of stuff. I still mark down every client, everything. My whole life goes into journaling. And so this one is called Stress Less Journal. And it's loose leaf paper, um, just paper with lines. And it just says stress less. And you're just supposed to, I guess, fill the page with your thoughts, things that are on your mind and once you dump it on the page it's done with like and that always works for me because I don't want people to think that my life is just perfect like people know when I'm going through it like if I'm mad at my boyfriend I'll tell my friends like I ain't fooling with him right now but just to go on for an hour talking about how I feel and my strength it's hard for me to do that because I'm just used to having other people lean on me and being you know anyway I dump my emotions in books so I wanted a fresh journal this is the thickest one I could find on Amazon and baby when I'm having hard times I will be writing in this it's a black girl holding her head like she's stressed out her hair is wrapped up like me most of the time never have my hair done because I'm always taking care of other people she's real cute she look like she a boss like I see the blazer I see the look going on like she has her stuff together but she's stressed out you know what I'm saying she stuff just ain't all the way where she wanted to be so i said i gotta get this um and it was like two dollars on amazon no lie two dollars these journals be so cheap but yeah let's get this vlog started got the shirt it says georgia state university i think i showed y'all like the um rough draft of it uh, these are pictures of just these when we went to new orleans back in october when we celebrated her cancer anniversary but it has her name at the bottom in the year y'all it's freezing cold um, i have my my big old but i feel like the pink clash with the school colors so i'm wearing my leather jacket but yeah y'all i'm rambling um dog i look crazy Let's go. <laughs> I just came back to say I ended up wearing both freaking jackets because it's that freaking cold. Ooh, can't get in there quick enough. Yes, 
just see with the light up. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, She's nasty. Hey y'all, so it is not Thursday, it's Thursday night, which is the following day from what y'all probably just seen a few seconds ago, just this graduation day, her graduation was beautiful, her celebration <clears throat> at Papa Do's was really nice, um, I was able to meet a couple of her friends that I haven't met before, I pretty much met a lot of people in her circle, but Yesterday was cool, <clears throat> um, and then today I've been doing hair all day. I didn't vlog any of that because I didn't want this vlog to be about business, but I had a house call. I had knockless braids today and then some kids, uh, so I went to those house calls, and then after that I went and made a couple of stops because in one of my previous braider vlogs, I believe the most recent braider vlog that I did, I went to Angie's because I had specific things in mind that I knew Angie sold. But in the meantime, while I was doing here today, I realized that there was things that I actually needed that I was running low on that I didn't get. So I went by Beauty Master on the way home from those house calls today and I grabbed some foam because I was running low on mousse. And while I was in there, I grabbed a few other things. I'm not going to show y'all all of that stuff because, again, I don't want this vlog to be about business. But when you spend a certain amount for the month of December, uh, Beauty Master gifts everybody who spends over a certain amount with the tumbler. Happy to have my new cup. I shop with them faithfully. If y'all watch my vlog, y'all know. So this tumbler cup is well deserved. Um, I also went and got some organic hair, just some, just some cheap bundles, because today is Thursday once again, and I leave to go to Florida next Thursday for my little Christmas getaway. But I'm not quite ready to do my hair a week before the holiday. I kind of want to do that style right before Christmas, but I'm tired of looking shot out too. Like my hair has not been done for over a week, and it's getting on my nerves. So I've been seeing this viral hack all over TikTok. It's this little claw clip tiktok hairstyle it started there then it flooded over to youtube but basically everybody has been parting their hair down the middle swooping it or like um laying their hair down on the sides with like two swoops i don't know what you call it but then they'll take half of their hair and claw it up in a claw clip and then let the back hang down y'all know i love a good half up half down style so i've been wanting to hop on this trend for a minute just didn't know when the perfect opportunity would be and i think this week would be the perfect opportunity it's a hairstyle that's not meant to be in your head that long so i think i'm doing i'm gonna do a quick weave not tonight i'm very tired i'll probably do it first thing in the morning before my friend Kay comes and gets her braids done or either right after Kay's appointment um, I'm gonna try that hairstyle. That hairstyle can be done curly or straight. I've seen it done both ways with straight and curly hair and I just personally like it better with the curly hair. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do the little claw clip thing, keep it in for a week and then this time next week I'll sew my real bundles in. So this will be like a, <clears throat> a quickie. So I did go and get that. I can include that in this haul. So I got three packs of that. I thought this one was really festive. It has gold and pearls in it. Um, and also rhinestones that I thought would be really cute for the Christmas holiday with nice little cream sweaters or whatever I decide to wear over the next week or so. Um, so I got me a fresh new claw clip to add some razzle dazzle to the style. So y'all will see me do that um, sometime tomorrow in the vlog. Um, I also came across this little cute unicorn nail brush right here. It's by this company called Magic. If you read the bottom right there it says nail brush and it's just for like when my sister is filing my nails sanding them down drilling them down or whatever or polishing them or anything any extra residue gets on my hand you know how your nail tech will just take it and brush your hands off i thought this was really cute it has like an orange tint to it slash pink tint and i know tan loves that and then it has the unicorn colors in the back not sure that she's crazy about unicorns it's more so me that thought it was cute but she's my nail tech so that's that i also came across this right here y'all and i think this is a game 
changer hold on real quick in my recent braid of vlog if y'all haven't seen that video definitely go check it out because i did purchase a lot of things from the hair store angie's and i showed y'all a really cute vlog of some great things um but i told y'all that i'm going back to my og edge control i just missed it um using the uh, edge booster edge control was cool i love the way it keeps my hair laid down but it doesn't have much of a smell to it this is biotin infused so it's good for hair growth and it also just has a really really nice smell but this is the edge fixer stuff right by the company red um they did a whole little collaboration with sweetie i talk about this edge control well i've been off of it for a while but anyway i used to talk about it all the time this is the sweet leche it's my favorite scent but they didn't have the sweet leche in the store they only had two cents i don't remember what the other one was but they had those two and when i seen it i said y'all i gotta have this um basically it's an edge brush you see it at the top but it's also a wand connected to it that can unscrew where you can hold your edge control in it so baby when i'm on the go i can put um, I think edge control comes in it, but y'all see it's not, it's thin, it's not much space for anything. When it runs out, I can refill it with my sweet leche. I think this is sweet peach that came in it. Yeah, this is the sweet peach fragrance that came in it. But when that runs out, I can fill it with my sweet leche, flip my edge brush over, get the, y'all. <laughs> I am notorious for leaving the house just on the rush with my edges not done like i may pull my bonnet off if i have braids or something like that then i get to where i'm going i'm like oh shoot i didn't do my edges this is a game changer where i don't have to bring a whole jar of edge control in the car like people just be coming up with stuff and i'm like why didn't i think of this but i'm gonna open it for you guys oh my goodness okay i got it out but it's a four in one so the four things are the comb the brush the actual tube that holds the edge control and then a case because i'm going to be on the go this will be going in your purse so you want a little case so that when it's um rubbing against stuff in your purse it's not getting residue on the other things however you put it on this is a little case but y'all this is what got me this was six dollars and i believe it's worth it um but you unscrew it like a mascara tube or a makeup tube and y'all the edge control it holds edge control i have to figure out a way to refill it I, i'm thinking that they want to set it up to where once you use it you have to keep buying it but i'll be refilling this and the company red just really um stole my heart with this combo uh, I get excited about little stuff, but to me, this is big. This is big. Like, I can whip out my edge control. Y'all know how we be about our edges. Y'all know how we be about our edges. So, get y'all one of these. I got the foam, which I also told y'all about. I got two bottles of this, my favorite mousse right now. And I also got these wispy lashes. I have a case of lashes on the way from Shein, I want to say. But until then, I got these really, like, wispy, fuzzy lashes. They're cute. They're cute. So, I got three pairs. I like to buy multiple at a time, like a case with multiple in it at a time so that I can be straight and set. So, that's that. I also got bonding caps because, of course, I told you I'm going to glue these tracks in on the back half of my hair. So, I'm excited to see how that hairstyle turns out. If it don't look right, listen, I'm only keeping it in a couple days. Anything is better than what my hair looks like now. And that's everything. At the Beauty Master, I ended up going in Walmart because Fenty needed a new bird feeder, a seed container. Um, Her seed container is just too small. And it's mainly because I give her other things than seeds. I might throw vegetables in her mix. I might throw grains in her mix, Um, chamomile, different things in her mix for her to munch on her... Um, see millet spray i put that in there and sometimes the little white containers that came with the cage just don't get the job done um so i got her a big deep dish that i can attach screw on to the side of her cage it's meant for gerbils hamsters parakeets whatever parrots and you just screw it on to her cage and it'll give me like more of more space to work with when i'm putting her meals together so I got her this. I got a couple other knickknacks um, from Walmart, but I'm not proud of what I got because I'm supposed to be staying away from junk food. So I'm not going to show y'all that stuff. But yeah, this is my haul for today. Actually, while, I'm, while I have my mind on it, I need to call my mom because I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to do with Fenty for Christmas. My sister's going out of town. She's not coming home, but she is going out of town. Got to hop on this while it's on my mind. Let's call Charlie. Yeah. <laughs>
don't know what she gonna say. Hello. Hey, Ma, what you doing? I'm just laying on the couch, sitting up here with Bunny. Hey, Mom. Hey, I'm working on North Pole. You working on the North Pole? Yeah. I'm so glad y'all in the spirit. I got a question for y'all. Sure. Okay, so, you know, I'm... Run it. <laughs> Not run it. Um, okay, you know Trell and Dequita going to New York for the holiday. Yeah. And you know, Auntie Reen is coming in a couple of days. I don't know what to do with Fenty, Ma. Mm. <laughs> if I have to, I can ask Tan or my friend Justice, but I would rather her be with me for the holiday. Uh, Harry said he ain't gonna bother him if you wanna bring this shit about her. <laughs> you worried about the mess. I'll make sure she don't um leave a mess. I'll put her I'll bring her cage covers, those little netted oh, covers. Just make sure that you got we got an old sheet or something that we can put underneath it too. Okay. Yeah, I got some I got some old um I got some old sheets and I got some new sheets. Okay. Yeah, that's what I was gonna do. 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 Okay. Yeah, that's what I gonna do. Okay. Yeah, that's what I was 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 gonna what am I gonna what you do? You gonna do with your baby? That's the thing you have to figure out when you become a uh, pet mom. I know. It is currently 8 a.m. on a Friday morning. My first client comes at nine. My friend Kay, and I need to eat something because I'm gonna be doing hair all day. But out of all the things I could have ate at home, I wanted a parfait. So here we are at Publix. What is this? This is interesting. This is a pumpkin spice parfait, and I'm intrigued. I'm also going to grab a smoothie. I got to run these back one more time because they were awesome. I went through a box of these in a few days. I'm going to get some muscles to have later. Maybe like a late lunch in between my second and third client. Some Capri Suns. It's the weekend before Christmas. I think I should leave out some cookies and cupcakes for my clients this weekend. I'm waiting on case, so I'm gonna go ahead and try my parfait. <clears throat> she hit me up and she told me she had Chick fil A, asked me if I wanted something. And had I not went and got this parfait, had I waited and been patient, I would have had breakfast. I don't believe this is granola, I believe this is cookies, like a graham cracker cookie. I love when they do the cookies instead of the granola. Um, but on top of it is apples and don't mind the angle right now. It's not about me. It's about the yogurt Well about the parfait I'm watching Jada on YouTube. Jada waited on a normally vlog on her channel She be so inconsistent, but for the month of December she been vlogging So that's what y'all hear in the background Okay, let's try this pumpkin spice yogurt Mmm In a minute, I'm gonna open the window and just let Fenty go. She does a lot. The goat to lay in natural hair. Got the bee holding spray. Gonna attack my little swoops with this. But you don't see the this one a little stiff.
Okay, y'all, the hair is done. I kind of let y'all jam with me a little bit while I was putting the hair in. Couldn't do too much because y'all know copyright, but it, it look okay. It look all right. I'm in a rush. My friends decided to make last minute plans. I have a client turned friend whose birthday is today, Taraya. So me, her, and Jelena gonna go out to Mirza for drinks and stuff. Hopefully I can make that because I also, my friend who graduated at the beginning of this vlog, she's having something tonight. Well, her friends are throwing something tonight and she invited me to come celebrate. So this is the look. I got on this full body like jumpsuit thing. I got it off Shein in like four colors, red, black, like a, a nude brown and like a, I don't know the other shade of brown, but it was too, like a chocolate brown maybe and like a nudish brown. Um, but yeah, I love these things. Only thing I will say is this one size fit all. So like right up in here, they left me too much room. But this is a cute little hairstyle, y'all. Honestly, just to get me through the week, I felt like, yeah. It's harder than it looks, I will say that. If you don't have any hair skills, you may struggle with covering tracks and all of that jazz. But I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. I wish I could have laid my hair down with a scarf a little longer, but I got to head out. I don't know if I'm wearing booty heels like a boot or sneakers but i gotta figure it out just these want to have me dead all right you want to have me dead okay she's taking forever <laughs> yeah it's us again hi oh cheese and crackers it's mastering it Woo! <laughs> Nobody can see behind. <laughs> period. Ah, period. It's you posing. Yeah, we at Waffle House. Yeah, this Waffle House is about to be so good. I got a hash brown bowl with eggs and cheese, sausage, and a waffle, of course. Oh, I'm about to mess it up. Yeah. Peer pressure, y'all. Shut up. <laughs> Take a shot. Cause we we ain't agree to shots. And just touch down the United States of America. Now how you said we ow ow right ow ow. ow. This is a cream mojo. This is my favorite Christmas drink. I ain't get one. Girl, yours right there. Hey, go get it. It's right. Where's this? It's right there. Oh, you want me to pass it? Doesn't even play because I ain't taking no time. Okay. Okay. All right. What my look like? Huh? It's too low. Well, no, it's good. It's back, good. Just back it up, song. Right here. Mm -hmm. So you can mm -hmm. squeeze in. And it's me. Was it Kelly? Oh. Thank you. I don't know what uh, little egg did with the straws. Um, actually, they're on the table. Little cocktail stir. Yeah, the production. Thank you. Take two. You don't take one. Yeah, yeah. 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 Okay. All of that. All right. Cheers to do money. Good, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <coughs> it's smooth. But when it hit your chest. When it yeah. hit my chest. That ain't bad. It's not. Yeah. It tastes good with that um summer berry. When it first hit my tongue, it was giving night quill, but yeah, it, it had a, that, yeah. Yeah. But shut them the bottle. Probably can't find it. It's kind of exclusive. They have it in all colors too, in different flavors. <laughs> they have the bubble gum, but every color bubble the bubble rainbow. Bubble bubble I might have to run it either. back with another flavor. Yeah. That's oh, what's that? That white, gray, black gray, black gray. Yeah, because you can get the Judy. And Jazz, what's this? A cran mojo. A cran mojo, y'all. So I'll heat up with a twist. The lush has sucked hers down. <laughs> Girl. <laughs> What you doing with that, Jazz? Garnish. Yeah. And the second drink is. Tahiti Kulai. Yes. So, Jazz has a. What is it? A series. Drink Miss. Drink Miss. 2022. Making Christmas themed cocktails or festive cocktails. And we having a little Get sip and see. I right, carry on the content. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to put this over. <laughs> we in right. class too. Mm -hmm. Pull a bit more. No.
we got some catching up. Oh, I feel like my screen. That's better. Yeah, I think that's better. Yeah, y'all, we got some catching up to do. So last night I ended up going out with my friend just these. I had two different like plans last night. I had a client slash friend's birthday, and I also had just these little. She invited me out to celebrate with her for her graduation. Ended up just going out with Justice. Had a time. Yesterday in the vlog, I did my friend's K hair. She got like the blonde ombre box braids. I put a little snippet of it in the vlog. But we were talking, and I had remember I told her that I would come by. She said her and Jazz, one of our other friends, um, was making some cocktails tomorrow. Jazz got this whole like real series, this Instagram series going on where she's making a cocktail every single day leading up to Christmas. And so today was supposed to be her content day to kind of work on all of that. And Kay was gonna help her because Kay have the content stuff on lock, like as far as the angles to get. Y'all see those clips I just put in. So I pulled up over there and I had a good time. I've been over there a couple of hours. Now I'm rushing home because I ended up squeezing somebody else in. Um, he had an appointment earlier this week and he canceled. So I let him reschedule for today. Rushing home to do him. I was supposed to go back out and do some more Christmas shopping, but that may have to happen tomorrow. Because right now, listen, <laughs> the way I'm feeling when I'm finished with his hair, he's lucky the thing that he's getting only takes an hour because I want to lay down. But it was so nice. Jazz does her thing with the bartending, y'all. So many cute cocktails. I thought I could make a drink. I don't have nothing on K and Jazz. Like, I keep hanging with them. I'm going to have the cocktail stuff on lock. But yeah, they were creating drinks. K just ended up getting a brand deal with um, Jam Jar. So she had a reel to make for them. And I just recorded some BTS um, for them or whatever. And then now, heading home to make some money. And then, I don't know if I'll catch up with y'all later today. If I do end up back in the stores to do some Christmas shopping, it's not like I can show y'all any of this stuff because I'm about to post it the weekend before Christmas. That's a whole week that my family will have time to come across this video and find out what they're getting. So, I don't really think I'm a vlog me shopping. So, we'll just see how tomorrow goes. This video may just go up tomorrow, but for right now, I'm feeling good. Like, she was making different festive drinks and every drink required something different. And it's me wanting to taste them all because they look so good. Like she had the dry ice going, the crushed ice going, the mint leaves, the cranberry. Like it was a fun day. Hey y'all, so it is now Sunday and I decided to just end the vlog where we left off yesterday because the fun really ended yesterday. Today I'm back to work. I have two clients today for hair and then after that I want to wrap up my Christmas shopping. I wanted to have all of my Christmas shopping done this weekend. I do not want to be in the madness Monday through Friday. Listen, <laughs> I don't want no part. Some people get a thrill from being in the stores every day leading up to Christmas. That's not my thing. Like, I really don't want to have to go in the mall. If I could get everybody's gift or if I could have gotten everyone's gift online, I would have preferred that. But when it comes to buying clothes or like certain items for other people, I don't like to get them offline. I know my sizes. I know when to go up a size, when to go down a size what looks good what doesn't but for certain people i just got to see stuff in person i got to touch it i got to feel it to know that it's true to size it's certain objects that amazon no longer has prime available for getting closer to the holiday it may normally have two-day shipping but because of the holiday flood or the holiday rush certain stuff is getting pushed back i don't want to risk anything not making it in time before christmas so Today's the day I'm just going to finish off everything I need to finish off. Whatever I don't have, I won't have. And who I haven't gotten things for, it'll be gift cards. Like, I want to be through with it. So, I'm in the vlog here today. I hope you guys enjoyed my fun vlog. <laughs> Working Brittany and outside Brittany, yeah, they ain't the same. I don't know who that person was this week in this vlog because I was a little turned up mainly off camera but i enjoyed my weekend i enjoyed having time to myself i enjoyed my friends just celebrating just these and hanging out with the girls yesterday creating content so i hope you all enjoyed that too i love you all and see you in the next video